So this is my first or last day of school. This is mono day five. Hey, should we share what we're doing this summer? Like first day of summer, we tell you guys where we're going. What's up guys, good morning. It is Thursday morning. And uh, it's not just any Thursday morning, it's my last day of school. Um, so actually our school actually ends on Friday. Um, but we're leaving on our trip Friday morning. So this is my first or last day of school. And um, Brennan's already at school, but for Katie. She has not moved a bit. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I'm gonna head up. It's like 8.20ish right now. Uh, actually, I'm gonna brush my teeth, finish getting ready. I'm gonna head up to school and uh, be back. And that's gonna be my last day of seventh grade. Seventh grade was an awesome year. Uh, so it's, I'm kind of sad that it's over, but happy it happened. Um, but also, I can't wait for summer, so yeah, let's do it. Eleven o'clock in the morning. This is Mono Day Five, I think. Mono Day Five for Katie. So she went to sleep last night around eleven, and then woke up at woke up at three. Couldn't go back to sleep. Finally woke me up at five. So I came down and watched a movie with her. We watched Spider-Man: Homecoming. That was a really good movie. Anyway. So she could fall asleep. She finally fell asleep again at around 7.30 and has been sleeping now till 11. Um, she has a paper due today. She worked on some of it yesterday and she has to finish it. She's due in like an hour and a half. So, um, because it's half day of school today. So she has to get it in before the end of school. So I hesitate. I don't want to wake her up because the instructions from the doctor were let her sleep as much as she can. So I'm not sure what to do. Um, Hmm, I think I'm going to let her sleep for a little bit more. Maybe just try to wiggle her awake. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do. It's hard as a mom because they said that she seriously could be like this, like sleeping and miserable, like her throat is on fire. And it's just a virus, so there's really nothing you can do except Motrin, so, which is like pain relief. Um, so, um, anyway, they said she could be like this for like two to three weeks before she starts to like feel better and but the fatigue could last for a long time so anyway we're trying to nurse her along but you know she was with Molly yesterday her friend she wants to like she gets so sick and tired of just laying around <laughs> so it was nice that she was up and around with Molly yesterday but I really do think she should rest a little bit more than she has been all right guys well I'll let you know what goes on it's the last day of school for Brennan and Ryan because they do um on vacation on Friday and today's Thursday and then Kate um, her last day of school, really, I suppose, unknowingly, was last week because she was exempt from this whole um, this whole week of school because it, she found out on Sunday that she had mono. But um, she's going to, so it really isn't, I mean, it's her last day of going to school, but today she has to turn in an assignment tomorrow. She's going to take a test. Mm -hmm. Yesterday she went in and took a biology test. She has to take math tomorrow. So she's not really done yet, but kind of done. All right, stay tuned. So I'm making Katie some tea. She has woken up. Morning, Katie. Oh, <coughs> oh, hi, sweet bones. All right, we're making her tea. This morning she has, what does she have? Jasmine with hibiscus. One of her favorite things is honey, and it makes her feel so much better. I'm gonna drop some honey in there for her. Come on, honey. Go. I heated it up. Maybe I heated it up too much. Let's see. Oh, that's good. There we go. So that's been soothing her throat, making her feel better. Yesterday she went through four tea bags of what was it yesterday? It was berry tea, I think. Raspberry delight. Something like that. Raspberry zinger, that's what it was, raspberry zinger. So Kate, let, you gotta let me know if this is enough honey or not. It seems like it didn't come out enough. Here you go, sweet girl. I'm hoping that that'll make her. Here you go, love. Thank you. You're welcome. She's got her Marvel pants on, so she's kinda like a superhero. That's not it. Yay. I wish. 
Okay, I'll bring a computer over. She has to do a case study today for child development. Hey. All right, it is summertime for Brennan. Welcome home from school. Hey, how'd your math thing go? Uh, I told you not to send me to school. Okay, this is the weirdest thing. So the teacher said if people come to school today, which is the second to last day of school, people should be coming to school. She was going to give them a test, a graded test. If they didn't come, she wasn't going to count it. So I don't understand. Do you think that maybe it's extra credit? She it's was like, like... It's pretty easy, but like I have no idea why you give us a test on the... Yeah. Last day. It was our last day of that because that's a B day. Um, oh. Yeah, that was just four that was just an A day. Okay. Weird. But you think you did well? Like, do you think it would help your grade? I hope so. Yeah, that'd be good. I kind of hope she counts it. <laughs> well, I kind of think that maybe that's why she's doing it, like to encourage people to come to say, I don't know. You could raise your grade. No, I don't know. I like she should have given you a test that was things like, What's your favorite color? What's your name? Exactly. What's four plus three? All right. Well, you know what? What do you have to look forward to this summer? A lot. Yes. Travel, hang out with my friends, water polo. Yeah. yeah you know what I have to look forward to? Mono. Laying on the couch. <laughs> getting popsicles. Oh. My whole summer. Katie. <coughs> oh. <coughs> How long is she going to be like that? They said she'll be like this for probably two or three weeks, and then uh, it'll be... No, no, no. And then it'll be about six weeks until she's not fatigued anymore. <laughs> I know, so it potentially could be through the end of July. <laughs> hey, should we share what we're doing this summer? <gasps> should we share that big trip we're going on? I'm hi, sure. Molly! Aw, hi, Corey! Hey, Did girl. you know they were coming over? No. You guys are so Why sweet. Hi, Corey. Know. Look at you. Did you <laughs> pick flowers flower. along the way? Aw. <laughs> oh. Thank you. I like it. Is it summer for you yet, or are you going yeah. to school tomorrow? I'm not going to you school. are? Happy yeah. summer! Yeah. How about you, Molly? Are you going to school tomorrow? Yeah. Seriously? Your parents said it was okay? No, I'm um, going to North Carolina. Oh, happy summer. All right, you guys, let's party. What should we do? Eat. Okay, what let's do you eat. Mean, what should we do? What? Oh, Katie oh, asked. Yeah. Katie's finishing a case study for school. I have to take Why it in. Why pulled this lace that you just gave me? It's so Why cute. did you not give me this uniform? All right, see you guys. Ladies and gentlemen, for me, it's officially summer. Woo! It feels so good to say. Yes. Okay. So, um, every year, at, like the end of school, they do like an ice cream thing. Uh, so all out, all throughout elementary school, you like get off the bus stop and a bunch of parents have like ice cream in there. Uh, but I think they had one this year, but it was like only for elementary schoolers because we don't actually get out until tomorrow, but I'm not going to be here tomorrow. Uh, but the elementary schoolers got out today, so they did it today. But I can't get anything because we didn't like contribute and I'm not in elementary school. Elementary school. <laughs> so, uh, kind of mad about that, but, uh... She, Mom was like, y'all, get you an ice cream at McDonald's if you want. And I was like, oh, thanks. Because so, he's yeah. my little, first, he's my first, little boy. First ice cream at, uh, uh, of the summer. That's right. First summer ice cream. Let's go. Do you think you should maybe set a goal to eat ice cream every day in the summer? Maybe. So, Jack, <laughs> no, that's crazy. a horrible goal. Why would I want to eat ice cream every day in the summer? I mean, that sounds good, but, like, I want to stay healthy. Yeah. Or, I'm not really... Like a health expert, but, <laughs> but maybe ice cream every day is not a maybe good idea. Maybe ice cream every day might be one of the Well, congratulations! Happy summer. So, what does your summer have? We have the man trip coming up. We have. Summer I'm summer? not allowed to tell you guys a lot of stuff. Okay, really? So, You're not? Like, I can't leak anything. I mean, well, you have man trip. You have summer swim team. Summer swim team. Junior, junior Olympics. Junior Olympics. And then a big trip out to California. We're going out to California. Big trip. Uh, after that. Yeah, no, I can't say anything else about it. I was going to say something else, but I can't say anything about it. Maybe we'll share it at the um, end of this video. What actually, do you think? I don't know. Like, first day of summer, we tell you guys where we're going. Maybe. That's a good idea. Maybe. I like that idea. We'll see. We have some... Um, <sighs> Paraphernalia at home that we can share with them, like What's some paraphernalia. Paraphernalia is like um, materials and stuff that will show where we're going. It's like marketing mm. materials and oh, like um, trip trip supplies. All right, but all right. So we're at the store now. We're gonna go and get ice cream a little later. So yeah, we're, yeah, we're getting medicine for Katie because she's at home 
sleeping yeah. and her throat is really, really bad. She hasn't been able to eat anything yet today and it's the really four, almost right. four o'clock. Oh, sorry. So, yes. so we're getting her medicine, so hopefully her swelling will go down. Yeah, okay, throat. so Katie's sick and we're getting some medicine. Bye. All right, you guys, fast forward to it's late at night now and there's Brennan and there's Ryan and we are very excitingly watching. Quick, quick. Oh. Oh. Tina. The Golden State Warriors play the Toronto Raptors, which is uh oh, which is the um, NBA Finals. So it's a little tense right now. It's 86 to 88 with two seconds left. Come on! Oh no! It's the third period. Sorry. Oh, oh, third period. Sorry. They're getting mad at me. They don't like watching games with me because I scream and stuff. Okay. Okay. All right. Bye. There's little baby girl. She's awake though. You slept a lot today, didn't you, Bob? Yeah. How was today compared to yesterday? Also, my face, like, I look like I'm, like, sick. Like, I look <laughs> like I'm dying. So just disregard that, please. Mm. She's a little bit pale. And keep in mind that my lymph nodes are swollen, so I'm not <laughs> actually a beast. Comment down below, you guys, if you've ever had mono before or if you know anyone that's had mono. <laughs> like... I guess I've known a couple don't people. Don't pull that up. I don't want to see myself. Oh, okay. Which is so unlike me. <laughs> Katie Elizabeth, um, talk to me about what your day was like today. Was it better than yesterday or worse? Like, do you feel like you're getting better or worse? Worse. Yeah. I feel terrible. Today was the worst day so far. It was bad. It was actually a really bad day for Kate. Um, Why do you have to get that angle? Like you already oh, know, like sorry. Mono isn't doing me any favors. <laughs> okay, you. I'll get you and that angle. And if you angle. drop that on my face, I will hurt you. I won't. Okay, so let me give you the I'll update. Stick your mouth. Oh, that's not nice. Jeez, oh man, she's getting a little uh, angry having mono. -y. Okay, so this is the deal. I don't want to see myself either. <laughs> but I, I, I suppose we could tell you the story while we're like showing you the clock or something. Should we show them pictures instead? This is what we used to look like. Neither Can of us want to be here. Can turn off my lights so, my, so bugs don't keep flying through my window? Yes, I will. Anyway, so Katie's day, this is the deal. You guys saw her a little bit earlier today, but as the doctor said yesterday, it's going to get worse before it gets better and it got worse today. So she was to the point where her throat was so closed that she couldn't swallow and she couldn't eat anything. So it was three o'clock today and she hadn't even eaten anything. So I called the doctor and they prescribed um, a steroid, some prednisone that would help, help with the swelling. So I got that for her by like 4.30, I guess. So finally around five, maybe you had some soup. And we even got Chick-fil-A. Yeah, it was after five. After five? It was five. like eight. <laughs> oh, it might have been that late. Yes, because we got Chick-fil-A. So when I was in the car with Ryan, you guys saw us, we were on our way, we went to Chick-fil-A, of course, because it's last day of school and whatever. And we got some um, milkshakes and everything. <laughs> Kate couldn't even eat that. But what was really nice was her friends right after school. I guess you saw them. Molly and Corey came over, and they were here for a long time. It was so nice. What else? So anyways, the prednisone and some Tylenol started to make her feel a little bit better. She had two bowls of soup today. And like half a milkshake. Half a milkshake. Okay. That's good. So you're gonna sleep just to take some more medicine and then and then hopefully sleep through the night tonight. And then she has to take a math test tomorrow. So we'll be at school in the morning and then she'll be done. A math test and a math quiz. Mm -hmm. And then she'll be done. What made you happy today, babe? Maybe starting to feel better? Well, I don't. Not sorry. If you, I don't mean to say that because I know you're not. But I mean when when the uh, um, watching Stick It with Molly. Oh yeah, we got to watch Stick It. I'd never seen it before. It was a good movie. Yeah, Molly stayed while we watched Stick It. Corey had to go. She had practice, right? I literally spent so much time and effort getting my face and body to be tan, <laughs> and now I look like an egg. <laughs> Good night, sweet dreams. I love you. Want to take us out? Oh, don't take us out because the boys are still downstairs watching basketball. No, can you please get my medicine? I will. Good night, baby Carla. Oh. You go Stay tuned to see how Kate gets better. Or worse. We'll have a nice day tomorrow. The boys leave tomorrow for their epic trip, so it's just going to be you and I tomorrow. I know, that'll be exciting. Probably doing nothing. That's okay. That's what you're supposed to do. Uh, I can't we'll watch do movies. We'll I watch can't movies. do nothing. Maybe we'll go for a walk. Let's go for a walk. I can't. Okay. All right, these guys are getting very excited. The game. What is it? 9.6 seconds left. The Warriors are down by one. There we go. This could be good. This could be bad. I think the Warriors have the ball. Insane.
This is utter insanity. I can't remember five of this game. <laughs> this is only game six. Right? To go to game seven. Get the rebound! Get the rebound! Foul! <laughs> so guys, this is Brennan. Um, end of a pretty intense day. Uh, I stayed up really late watching the Warriors lose and um, watched all my money go down the drain, so that was tough. Um, so, looking for a job. If anyone knows jobs around here, so I need to make some money pay for how expensive I am. Um, what are you happy today, Ryan? Are you happy today? Actually, hold up. Was... Packing. Oh, yeah. Packed bag. We're leaving tomorrow for... Mandrup. For where? Mandrup. To where? To Wyoming. Mm. And beyond. In Glacier. In Glacier. In Idaho. Are we actually going to Glacier? Oh, yes. yeah, Idaho. Dude, we might go golfing there. That's icy, dude. And? Oh, yeah, I have a golf trip there. And, of course, Jackson Hole. Oh yeah, Jackson Hole. Alright. Uh, <laughs> what made you happy today? Uh, what made you boy happy today was it being the last day of school for me. Seeing all my friends. Well, uh, like saying goodbye to all my friends was tough, but like, Thanks. still, it was, it was fun to be, be the last day. And, uh, yeah. Nice. It was also my last day of school, um, so that made me happy. And also, um, I just love watching sports. Watching the finals was awesome. And I watched some of the, uh, what's it called, US Open today, and they're at Pebble Beach, so. Man, sports are still in, in full swing. And All then right. we still got baseball when this finishes up, or when golf finishes up. I can't wait for football. And then, uh, yeah, football season game. coming soon. I got a lot of bread on the Chargers, so. I'm going to have to stop betting on sports, that's probably not good. But comment below, maybe you guys have been able to Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.